This is where they can be dangerous now. Torres. Oh, Griezmann's in here. Griezmann, but I've got Madrid! They're ahead of the tie again! And that's what they've been waiting for. One mistake. One chance to pounce on the counter. On a play, look at this, they break, they get 2v2. You could probably argue that maybe Griezmann is offside. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to our brand new FIFA 21 player review. This is Leo here bringing you another special player review and today we are swinging our talents to the Liga Santander and we are going to be looking at Antoine Griezmann, the Barcelona man. Everybody thought he was going to be transferred. He ended up staying and he received this magnificent card for FIFA 21. I know the pace sucks but aside from that, this card looks fantastic man. He's an 87 rated striker, 79 pace, 85 shooting. 84 passing 88 drilling and 72 physical good stuff there he is 5'9 medium medium left footed four star three star and hopefully that is not a problem there we shall see and then i bought him for 96k which is really cheap and he's definitely one of the better strikers center forward center attacking mid options in the liga santander so that's why we're taking a look at this beastly Antoine Griezmann onto the attribute details guys the pace of 79 I mean what can you do I uh, probably will apply a hunter on him because I am going to be playing him a striker probably a hunter or hawk I don't know yet we shall see and I definitely will let you know onto the shooting elite level shooting 89 attack positioning 80 finishing Ah yeah 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 if I shoot it with the left it better go in onto the passing of 84 85 vision 83 crossing, 85 free kick accuracy, 84 short passing, and then to round it out, 82 long passing, and 86 curve. Every passing stat is in the 80, and that is what you love to see. And that's why he this guy can play cam as well, because his passing is fantastic for a forward. On to the dribbling, his best stat, 91 agility, talk about meta. And then that 83 balance as well, really good. And then aside from that, 89 composure, super clutch. And then every, every reaction ball control and dribbling is elite for this card. And on to the physical of 72, 86 stamina, he should last you the whole game. And then the 63 strength and 73 aggression is eh. I mean, it's alright, it doesn't really matter though, because he has really crazy stats. And last of the player traits, oh my goodness, he has so many. Finesse shot, flair, long shot taker, playmaker, outside the foot shot, chip shot, and technical dribbler. He has the top two key stats, in my opinion, for a forward, and that is a finesse shot and outside the foot shot. So, if I am on the right side and he's about to shoot it with the right, he'll probably shoot it with the left and shoot it on that outside foot. So, yeah, that is good there as well. And, yeah, man, that'll be enough of the intro for Antoine Griezmann. Is he a beast? Is he a not? We shall find out next. Game number one, ah, KDB on that side with Richarlison and Alan. Ah, yeah, yeah, it's gonna be a good game. Vamos, Griezmann. Oh, que pase para Crespo, se viene Crespo, Valdanito. And assist for Griezmann. Ah, the delay on the shot. There we go. I don't think, I think Crespo did not want to give the Griez, Griezmann his assist. Ah, there was a delay right there. Weird, man, because the delays right now in game, you're not really seeing them. That is, that's, that's worrying, man. Vamos, Crespo, Antoine Griezmann, Antoine, give it with the left, the goal, there we go, Antoine Griezmann scores the first goal for foot Leo FC, beautiful pass by Crespo, and then Griezmann, he does not miss on that left foot, we are up 2-1, vamos Antoine, Frankie, Royce, Aranguis, good pass to Griezmann, Griezmann, se la pasa para Marcos Llorente, fake stop, Nice, Llorente keeps the possession. Pass it to Frankie de Jong. Frankie de Jong se la pasa para Aranguis, Aranguis. To Griezmann, Griezmann. Ay, to Marcos Roy con el pecho. Oh, oh, what a play right there. That is all team effort, Griezmann. Good pass. And Marcos Roy almost puts it in the back of the net. Vamos, man. Vamos. Griezmann. 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 Ay, he got free right there. So close. Diego Carlos. Marquitos, Crespo, Griezmann, let's go, Griezmann, hey, that's a penalty ref, oh my goodness, that's a penalty ref, so that will conclude game number one for Antoine Griezmann, and yeah, man, he played really good, I'm expecting a little bit better, but this game was kind of weird for some reason, we ended up winning 4-2, and Antoine Griezmann gets a 7.7 .7 rating, one goal, one assist as well, never mind, I take it back, I did not know he had an assist, so, uh, yeah, fantastic game for Antoine Griezmann. Shots on target, 
one out of two passes completed, nine out of 12 doubles completed, 19 out of 17, and not much left to say for Antoine Griezmann's first game for Foot Leo FC. So let's go on to the second one. All right, Semedo. Tiene la pelota el francés. Crespo. Come on, make the run. Let's go. Oh, Griezmann. He takes the ball away from him. Se viene Griezmann. Ah, he moved the goalkeeper. I should have just crossed body that. Ah, he moved the goalkeeper to perfection. I can't hate on that. Crespo. Royce. Marquitos. Que pase para Llorente. Se viene el español. Vamos, Llorente. Que pase to Marcos. Come on. Griezmann. Ah, Griezmann. 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 Vamos. Crespo. Great pass. Griezmann. Let's go. Oh, that's a balance. That is the goal. No, he hit the post. I'm losing this game, guys. I hit the post with Crespo. And now I'm hitting the post with Antoine Griezmann on the left foot. Yeah, this is probably an L. Vamos, Marquito. Griezmann. Hernanito Crespo. Crespo to Griezmann. Let's go, Griezmann. Come on. The balance. The left. Yes, it is. Goal. Antoine. Griezmann only takes some, this time only takes some three minutes to score. And that is what I love to see, man. Beautiful stuff from Antoine Griezmann. Nice, Griezmann. Crespo, ah, que pase para de, ah, yes! We get an assist for Marquito Royce, and Crespo puts it up 2-1. Babe, but I can't. Can't say that uh, Griezmann's pass wasn't nasty as well. What a pass from Griezmann. And that is that outside the foot, man. What a pass. Wow. That team play out of this world. Oh, what an interception from Griezmann. Let's try the long shots. Griezmann. Ooh, he, ooh, ooh, ooh. That hit the post, I think. So close. Good interception by Griezmann. And he's, he's getting there. He wants that other goal, man. Vamos, Marco Llorente. Ah, que pase para Griezmann, se viene el francés, vamos. Oh, francés, que pase. Let's go. Ah, almost. Marquitos, Griezmann. Que pase with the left foot, se viene Crespo. He's throwing go Crespo, Crespo, Crespo. He's offside, but what a beautiful pass by Antoine Griezmann. Yes, we win it. Let's go. Griezmann hitting the post once again. And we win it in the 90th minute. Hey, I got to give props to uh, Griezmann. Eyes ah, by the skin of our teeth. We win that game. I know it was some cheese, but he got a cheese ball as well. And that ends the game for Antoine Griezmann. The third game played. Another fantastic performance. Unlucky with his shots to be honest but it doesn't matter he scored the first one and thanks to him we win this game three to two and yeah Griezmann 7.6 rating one goal zero assist but that 90th minute man that was more than an assist that was a W and we're so close to division one and Griezmann GG man GG but for more on Antoine Griezmann let's go on to the final thoughts on this crazy card. The World Cup winner Antoine Griezmann was a pleasure to play with this year. Again, I know a lot of people are getting turned off by that lowered pace, man, of his. I don't know what EA is thinking, just butchering these Griezmann's pace. But honestly, at 79, with the chemistry style, you will not have a problem. But anyways, let's go straight into the pros. Number one is going to be that 88 finishing on the left foot. Guys, he will finish 9 times out of 10. Yes, he did have some lad luck hitting the post. But I mean, what can you do? That's out of my controls. On to the second pro. That's going to be that 91 agility. Talk about meta, man. He's definitely an agile player. And that's why this card does not feel like a 79 pace card on to the third point and that's gonna be that 84 passing of his his passing is elite man on that left foot he will get it to your strikers he will get it to your center attacking me whatever formation you're playing he should be able to complete that really good pass with that left foot 
And then the last pro is going to be his 88 dribbling combined with the four star skills. And that just calls for a good time. So GG there. And on to the cons. The obvious con with Griezmann is that three star weak foot. On that right foot, it is not as reliable as you would like. But I mean, aside from that, that is the only con on this card. And on to the Leo tips. Number one tip is going to be he play, play him at cam is what I'm trying to say. I think that is going to be the best position for his card. I mean, if you put a hunter, maybe you can play him at striker. But honestly, he is French. He has really good linkable links. You can play him at center forward and have like a left wing. You can have St. Maximum. You can have who Rodrigo, Carrasco. And then on the right side, I don't, I don't know any French right sides at the moment. I can't think of any. But yeah, man, you have other faster French linked and Liga Santander as well that you can put up. So yeah, my recommended position is that cam roll. And then the last Leo tip is stay forward. Getting behind should be the instruction set for this card. He is medium, medium. So he needs that extra instruction so he can stay up top. And that will lead to a final rating of 9 out of 10. I really enjoyed this Griezmann card and he's definitely going to stay on my squad. So hopefully he is a able to perform in the very first weekend league for FIFA 21 and I'm really excited towards that and Griezmann is going to be a big part of it so yeah man anyways that will conclude today's review hopefully it helped you out in deciding what you want to do with your Liga Santander or French side I gave you a Griezmann review and I also gave you a Fakir review so go check that out and if you're interested man Fakir is a monster and Griezmann as well so you have a tough choice but if you have any questions just comment down below and I'll try to help you out but before I let you go I just want to say thank you so much for your support on instagram and youtube lately i have been killing it with the support and i love seeing that guys please take a second out of your day like this video subscribe to the channel and that'll be all for today this is leo i bid you goodbye and good night